Hello, this is Ever Ready Everything. We're doing a short review today on grow lights. We wanted to find some grow lights that could produce some nice reds in our uh, lettuce and uh, find out if the grow lights would work well with strawberries and tomatoes. This particular head is called Prize Head and it has some nice reds that have been produced by these lights in them. In all fairness, this head has been harvested twice already. We're ready to harvest it for a third time. Um, lettuce will actually regrow if you cut it off on the bottom of the stalk and leave a few leaves sticking out. So, going up here we have some oak leaf lettuce. And it has some nice burgundy colors early on as it develops. The burgundy colors lighten up just slightly, but it really adds, adds some really nice accents to your salads and does produce some nice reds. Back here we have a strawberry that's one of them that's blossoming right now, producing fruit. So these lights do really well for strawberries. We also have a nice beet plant that we planted just for this review for Active Grow. And as you can see, the beet plant has gone crazy and the beet plant is ready to harvest. It will also produce tomatoes quite well. In fact, we had a tomato like this one that grew all the way down to the end of the rail and I managed to pull it out and transplant it to our deep water culture area here. And it had blossoms on it when I transferred it. This one has some nice blossoms on it. We have some um, nice fruits that are starting to be produced. We have some that are actually red down here. They're kind of hiding all over the place a bit. But you know these active grow lights um, really do super for um, tomatoes and strawberries. And I know there's a lot of viewers that have commented that they really struggle trying to find lights that will do well for their strawberries and tomatoes. So um, I feel these do really well. Um, what I got, what I have installed here on my rail, I have um, the white, full spectrum white lights by Active Grow in the center of my rail. And on the outer edges, I've actually placed their red bloom lights. And I had extra and I wanted to put them on the outer edges to see if it would assist in the blooming process. In all fairness, um, I started off with all white spectrum in, in my rail and it, it produced great red lettuces and everything um, even without switching to these um, other bulbs. So. Anyways, this is our review Ever Ready Everything. I hope you'll leave your comments in the comments section. I'll also leave a link to um, these active grow lights that I've used. And I'll also leave some, create some future videos for pH meters and other electronic devices that will assist you in your hydroponics that I know absolutely 100% work. And um, Thank you for coming and watching our videos and we hope to see you again.